Welcome. This is crazy stuff. The EU is currently working on a draft law that provides for the expropriation of older residential buildings. All buildings that do not meet the new EU energy efficiency standards are affected. These buildings may no longer be used after 2030. I repeat that again. These buildings may no longer be used after 2030. That's already in seven years. Of course, there is no true expropriation. You just no longer have the permission to live in your own house or to rent it out. This logic follows seamlessly the German economics minister Robert Habeck, who, when asked whether he was expecting a wave of insolvencies at the end of this winter, replied, No, I don't do that. I can imagine that certain industries will simply stop producing for a while. How can businesses not be bankrupt if they stop producing is a baffling question. But anyways, that's the same logic now with their real estate plans. If you as a landlord own several apartment buildings, but it is not worth renovating them energetically, then you will no longer be allowed to rent them out. That means you have no rental income and the real estate becomes practically worthless. The bank where you got the mortgage will certainly demand it back and you are broke and end up in foreclosure. Now of course your property has no value because the property is no longer rentable or financeable which means total loss for you. That is exactly what Mark Carney, the UN Special Envoy for Climate Protection and Finance, announced in the middle of last year. Either you are in conformity with the climate initiatives or you end up as climate roadkill. As an investor, you have to be fundamentally clear about this. If the state does not come directly and take away your property, it can still easily forbid you to use it. They can just make up laws however they like, and you have to obey, and if you can't do that, then you lose the right to use your property. This represents a major scandal and injustice to citizens, as many owners of older buildings cannot afford the necessary renovations for financial reasons. Anyone who has ever renovated knows that these things can quickly run into the hundreds of thousands of dollars, especially with larger properties that are a bit older. And for some buildings you just can't even do that. It is not possible. I myself used to specialize in offering affordable housing. I bought and rented out many older apartment buildings. However, this will no longer be worthwhile because the investment costs can no longer be recovered from the rents. There are also the increased interest rates on mortgages, property taxes, and energy costs on top of that. Apart from that, Energetic renovations are actually a total scam and neither save energy nor are they environmentally friendly. But that's another story. I'm glad that I've seen all of this coming before and that I have gradually sold all my properties over the past two years. It can only go down from here. Probably have to start all over again in another country to build up a new real estate portfolio. A country that is not particularly involved with this kind of initiatives and ideally where properties are generally bought without a mortgage because then there is less leverage and prices cannot come back that much. So unfortunately, the prospects continue to get worse unless you set up a new business as a firm specialized in offering energy efficient renovations. There will definitely be a lot to do in the future. You have to look at this from both sides and make the best of the situation. In that sense, that's it for today. All the best to you.